last one? Um, a little bit, but um, it was definitely totally different than last time, too. Um, it was the same in the sense of uh, we did get a lot of fastball outs and uh, being aggressive with the fastball and getting early ground balls or fly outs. Um, so that was good. Two seamer was working for you again mm -hmm. as it was the last time. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, that's something that's came along pretty well lately, and uh, we've just been keep going back to it, and it's been working. So keep going to it. You felt the chemistry with Cam over the last few years. Has that been a help to have him back there? Uh, we've always had that. So we, like I said, we've um, we've pitched to, pitched and caught to each other for. <laughs> five years now so um, there's definitely some some uh, comfortability back there with him and um, whatever he throws down I feel confident in throwing oh it was awesome so happy for him um, it was it was a big point in the game too you know um, to get those runs and um, luckily the next inning I didn't get, get too much damage then you know we got out of that and uh, and kept the, the pretty decently Matt said he was just hoping for a walk, you know, the faces loaded. Did you know he had a little more than a walk? Well, yeah, well, I could tell on his 3 one swing he took a hack, and he was ready. So um, I think he got a similar pitch, and he handled it and put it out of the yard. For you as a pitcher to be in a tightly contested game and all of a sudden turn around and with one swing you got a five run lead. Just how great is that feeling for you as a pitcher, especially when it's your catcher doing it? Yeah, it is great, but at the same time you kind of got to treat it as it's still a tie game and go out there and try and get a shutdown inning. <laughs> Yeah, um, I just got, I got quick to the plate. I was rushing myself, and I just left him on side. 